is onion juice and onion hair oil useful for hair growth so we see in present scenario there are so many brands which are promoting onion hair oil onion juice and you can see so many videos which are telling you how to make onion juice at home and how to purchase it from the market so if it is actually helpful let us see today in this video let us bust this myth whether onion juice or onion oil is helpful for you i'm a hair doctor my name is dr preeti saraswat i'm american board certified hair transplant surgeon you can subscribe to my channel if you want to hear more about hair and skin facts so firstly let us see how onion is helpful for the shaft of your hair so when you use onion juice or onion oil what it does to the shaft it is full of sulfur keratin is the main protein for hair shaft keratin is made up by amino acids amino acids require a lot of sulfur so the other things which amino acid require is you get from your diet normal diet daily diet but sulfur is abundant in onion juice so this sulfur when it is present abundantly hair keratin grows well and you get good lustrous hair apart from this when you apply onion oil or onion juice it is a normal conditioner for the hair so how to make this oil i will tell you in a little while apart from that the onion is full of all the essential minerals vitamins and antioxidants which make the ph normal and neutralizes the acidity or alkalinity which may be there with your shampoo this is a very important fact so either oil or juice can help you in the shaft lustre when you apply onion it also reduces the split hair now a very common question comes to mind how to make onion oil at home so it's very easy let me just tell you quickly so very few tips are there you can take onion around 1.4 kg and you can make a puree and then you take out the juice then you take around 400 ml of coconut oil why coconut oil because it is the one of the most commonest oils which are applied to the hair and skin and with this you take around 40 g that is a medium to large size onion and you make a puree out of it so you take the oil you start heating on a medium flame on a pan saucepan or a kadai with a thick bottom you add the puree to it and then the, the liquid the juice to it and keep on stirring for about 20 to 30 minutes let it cool strain it and you can store it you are good to apply this on the head so if you are liking this video till now just tap the like button coming to the effect of onion on your scalp so when you apply the onion juice or oil on the scalp it increases circulation on the scalp it is the property of the onion also and the massage also which you give along with it so this increased blood circulation will obviously increase the nutrients for your hair roots and your hair will grow better the second point is that it increases collagen content of the scalp so when this collagen structure is increased on your scalp it increases the hair and and skin it improves the hair and skin and therefore they get better be it anywhere on the scalp on the skin but onion on the scalp will help you in this way the third way is that it wards off the lice and the parasites on the scalp if anybody has if you keep on applying at regular intervals you may not get it at all onion oil is full of micronutrients and also it is antimicrobial so it is antifungal as well as antibacterial so it helps you in decreasing dandruff in the hair if you have if you or any of your family or friends are suffering from hair loss or baldness or hair problems you can write in the comment section below we can help you with the hair solutions as well as hair transplant so i want to mention here that if you are having a hair loss which is female pattern hair loss or male pattern hair loss or you are having a disease in the scalp or you feel the hair loss is too much then you should not depend entirely on the onion juice or onion oil you should see a hair loss doctor you should see a qualified person who can help you with the diagnosis and the management long term management of your hair loss problem so always see for certified doctor most importantly american board certified hair transplant surgeons or members of international societies and get a thorough checkup of yourself but if you feel there is a little hair fall or you want your hair to be more thick or lustrous then you can have this home remedy in the form of onion 
onion juice or onion oil for any further hair loss problems you can call us on the numbers given below and get a consultation with us so one thing here which i want to tell you that many of my patients have told me doctor the smell of onion is not good we are not able to tolerate that so what to do now the solution is either you can add some lemon to it or some rose water to it if even then you are not able to tolerate so another thing you can do is that in your shampoo mix some coffee so that you get rid of the onion smell another thing is when you apply onion juice it's important that you know that your skin your scalp does not react to it so what you will do take some juice apply on some of your skin and you see that it doesn't itch it is not red and you are not allergic to it because that concentrate of onion juice sometimes it causes itchiness redness and flakes in the scalp so what you will do if it is so make the onion oil with less content of onion and more of oil another thing you can do is while applying the onion juice or onion oil mix equal quantity of aloe vera to it so that the side effects of onion juice or oil can be reduced to a minimum in addition to this if you want other home remedies for a good hair growth you can click on the video above the five room home remedies for better hair so So just to sum up what we have understood till now onion juice and onion oil can be used but in those cases where your hair fall has started or you want better hair if your hair fall is too much and you feel you are getting bald you may be having female pattern hair loss or excessive hormonal disturbance or nutritional disturbance you must see your doctor and comply with whatever he or she says you can share and subscribe to this channel if you want to know more about or you want to discuss what is the right procedure of choosing the doctor for your hair transplant you can click on the video on the left and if you want to know more about how and why you are having so much hair loss after pregnancy after delivery of your little one you can click on the video on the right so that you are benefited with the content